Hey YouTube, I'm going to show you something on wiring up this mini split, a mini split, particularly the model AR12HS, a lot of different models, I always refer to your owner's manual, but I really couldn't find nothing definitive, so I figured it out and I'm going to tell you how I did it, so I'm going to go inside and show you the breaker box. Okay, if you're going to wire up one of these mini splits, uh, again, refer to your manual. This is for an AR12 HF series. Uh, it's 12,000 BTU unit. The manual is not really clear. Videos are, you kind of have to put two and two and even three and three videos together to kind of come up with it. But here's the end result. First, need to install you a 220 volt double pole breaker into your circuit box. If you don't know how to do that, I would suggest you hire an electrician or YouTube it. But you install your breaker, then once you wire up your breaker, and this is my breaker wire here, I ran it outside, drilled a hole right through here, going to This breaker box now from this breaker box and you can see you only have one wire coming out of it let me see if I can get that off hold on a minute right there this is my power coming from the circuit breaker box into this quick disconnect wire this up and then run this wire from the other side of the disconnect all the way into the unit now into this unit you will see it has an L1 L2 these two top poles and you can't see it behind here I don't know if you can or not but behind here there's two more bottom screws so there's four screws here total two on the top two on the bottom your main power cable that comes in from the breaker box goes into the bottom two at the very bottom there's a little label behind this here it says power my white came in on the L2 side and my power came in on the black on the L1 side now next you attach another wire and these are 12 gauge because it's 220 volts you take another wire attach I attach the black to the L1 and the white to the L2 on the top two poles. That goes out into this bottom one here and goes all the way up inside and connects. I'm making a man cave by the way so I needed a split system. This is the wire coming from the unit, the outside unit. You connect it up. Come all the way across here. And up under there, you will see an L1 and an L2. So what you have to do is if outside you connected the white wire to L2. You need to do the same here. Connect the white lead to the L2. Connect the black lead to L1. Now, if you, if you want to do black on L2, the color wiring is yours. You just have to make sure, however you do it, these two wires match the outdoor unit wiring. Then, you have the 16 gauge right there it is real tiny little wires right there those 16 gauge is your communication wires and again wherever you start it's up to you i started outside and i did outside at the f2 connection well, the f1 connection was black so i'll connect my black here and i will connect my white here and that is all ah. I don't really know why some videos were so 
complex about wiring these it's pretty simple power from the breaker 220 volts out to a dip quick disconnect from the quick disconnect out to the unit I have to walk back and forth so I apologize from the circuit breaker to the quick disconnect from the quick disconnect to the bottom two poles then from the top two poles out of the unit connecting them up to the indoor unit that's how you wire this particular brand thanks for watching